Hello guys. Yeah, so I'm just starting my second journey this season. Uh, so I took a bus to the train station in Oshti Paneri. And now I'm on the platform waiting for the next train. Which is, gonna be, which is gonna be mine. And that train is going to Lesdeni. Where I'm gonna leave the train and gonna do some hiking five kilometers to the spot or at least the place where I can find a roughly spot to set up the camp and stay for the night should be a beautiful place there's train leaving to the Vilna center yep so see you in the next bit Hey yeah guys, so I left the train station, some really nice grandpa offered a ride, so I made a halfway ride with the car, which is nice, since I'm still hurting from the last journey. <laughs> yeah, look at this nice place, how beautiful it is. I'll just spend a little bit of time, since I saved time, so now I can waste some, waste some time walking around filming this creek. Alright guys, so my journey is beginning. I'm gonna go there, turn left, straight into the forest. Let's go. Alright guys, so I entered the forest and I need to go uphill now. <laughs> <coughs> Yuck. Yeah. It's gonna be from here four and a half kilometers to the first probable spot where I want to stay someone was digging the sand from here and there and there and there fucking everywhere probably some animals for some reason maybe hogs eating roots nice to go to the place where there's fresh air <sighs> what the hell <sighs> seems like someone made some art out of the tree misery <laughs> there's some more and more it's like a gate to the forest <laughs> <laughs> All right, one more art, and it says Kragju Palakalni, so it's Castle Hill of Kragju. <sighs> one more thing like this, tree seems alive, and it's not new, so that's good. <sighs> okay, now I've gone up all the way up a hill. That's nice. Now I can walk in the relaxed, leveled road. <laughs> Alright, so noticed that at least for now there is no mosquitoes yet. Because it's early spring, they're hatching in some parts at least of the wilderness where I've been before. Near the forest, you already see a few of them time to time. People as well reported about the ticks being the problem as well. Yeah, so hopefully there are not there is not too many of them here. <laughs> uh, birds in the treetops singing their songs, the songs of their people, as they say. <sighs> Forest just keeps on getting prettier the more I walk. And uh, on the map, noticed within like. 
one kilometer or so, there's a turn to right. And over there, there is like some sort of magical healing spring. So I'll dump my water, I'm gonna get some of that. <laughs> okay, so I just arrived. So that's if to be translated like straightforward, Pinicola is like a name which is comes from the word to braid, like braided hair. And this thing just is like a source of the spring. Yeah, so that Shultinis word means the source of the spring, basically. So I have all the gear. Alright, so I should turn right, all the way down there. Some rail, handrail. Oh, there's an English, so I don't need to translate anything. You can pause if you want to read. And oh yeah, there is some more information. You can pause as well if you want to read it. Strange wizard, famous throughout the area. Uh, I'll read it. Okay. Oh, I can see there's some water in there. All right. I have a staircase. Yeah, there's decent flow, it's definitely drinkable, 1000% just because there's cups and there's information about it. It goes straight from the ground, from underneath, so there's no way for the bacteria to form in there. And look at there, it's like a tiny, tiny cave. Do you want to go too, too close, not to break or disturb anything? I'm gonna go empty my bottles and I'm gonna fill them all with this water. <laughs> I'm gonna be so lucky, hopefully. Hey guys, so I'm gonna go fill up all my bottles with fresh spring water blessed by wizard of the forest. happy if I would knew there's spring water I wouldn't take any from home because it's heavy that's that's cool 